rubber boa, which is also called Dumoyi in Pakistan and India, means two-faced snake. Due to the shape of its tail, look more like its other head. Rubber boas are considered one of the most docile of the boa species and are often used to help people overcome their fear of snakes. So the question is, are they venomous? And the answer is a big no. They are not even aggressive or harmful. The rubber boa is a small non-venomous snake from the family Boadae, native to the western United States and southwestern Canada. Let's go to second question, are they a good pet? Everything about a rubber boa snake is easy from their temperament, curve, feeding, and hygiene. Most snakes are a pet to be observed but not to be played with. Rubber boas are the type of pet that a person can interact with, as they enjoy the warmth from their hand and will curl up on one for hours. Like other boas, the rubber boa variety is entirely non-venomous. They do in fact have teeth, but they practically never bite. This is all for the rubber boa. Let's go to our next snake from the same family. Smooth Scale Boa, or Banded Boa, also known as the Indian Sunset Boa. They also have a head same to the shape of its tail, look more like its other head. Their qualities are much more similar to the rubber boa, or you can say the same snake with a different unique colors. They are also often used to help people overcome their fear of snakes. So the same question again, are they venomous? Answer is no, they are not, and not even aggressive enough to give a bite or harmful to any human. The smooth-scaled boa is also a non-venomous snake from the family Bodai. Let's go to second question, are they a good pet? Just like rubber boa snakes, they are easy from their temperament, care, feeding, and hygiene. Rubber boa and smooth-scaled boa are the type of pet that a person can interact with, as they enjoy the warmth from their hand and will curl up on one for hours. Like other boas, Let's move to our next snake. Rough Scale Boa, or Sand Boa, also known as Russell's Boa. They are also from the same family of Boadae. Their scientific name is Gongolophus conicus. Are they venomous? Red Sand Boas are extremely shy, harmless and non-poisonous snakes. Since they stay under the surface and dig soil they have strong and hard heads. This species has thick, knobby scales across its muscular body. They have a beautiful scale texture over their skin which make them more attractive. And their texture looks quite similar to the venomous snake Russell's Viper. That makes people to buy them who love to keep an attractive snakes. Also, unlike most snakes, its tail does not taper to a fine point. Are they a good pets? A sand boa is an excellent beginner snake, and if you like the idea of frequently handling your pet, this might be the snake for you. Even the most spirited sand boa prefers to try to escape, jerk or spasm rather than bite. You can look at the shape and length of the tail to help you decipher whether or not your snake is a male. Males will have a tail, the portion of the snake starting after the cloacal opening, that is thicker and longer than their female counterparts. Let's move to our next snake. Orange diadem, or red spotted diadem. These species known commonly as the diadem snake and the royal snake. It is a species of large snake in the subfamily Colubrinae of the family Colubridae. They are pale buff or sandy grey. 
with a median series of dark blotches and smaller dark spots. Diadem may attain a total length of 1.8 meters, about 6 feet, of which about 34 centimeters, 13 and a half inches is tail. Question. Are they venomous? No, these species are not venomous just like boa. The diadem snake, Spaleros ophis diadema, is one of the non-venomous oviparous snakes of the family Colubridae. with a wide distribution in Iran. Question. Are they a good pet? Yes, they can be kept as a pet. They are a bit aggressive and not for beginners. But they are good pets if you know how to handle snakes. This is all for today's video. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more interesting upcoming videos. Please like and subscribe our channel and press the bell icon to see our more stories on nature, wild and pets.